Messy Happily and Family Fun Gardening. Hello everyone, I am Essie Happily, don't mind Matt legend, but today we have a treat for you all. It's going to be me versus Marcus planting up this moss container that I won from Garden Queen's channel, which I'm very happy about. You know when you get in giveaways and you be like, it ain't no way I'm going to win, I won. So today we're going to see who can plant the best container. Gun Queen told me that most people wouldn't know how to plant up in a small container. I'm looking down at the container, as beautiful as it is. Watch until the end and you will understand my response to that statement. We're going to see who can plant the best one. So stay tuned for the game. Plant container competition. Plant container competition. First we have Legend. Placing soil inside the container. Next, you will notice me placing the barberry in the center of the container. I have removed all the soil from the roots. This will allow the roots to spread and grow. Although I'm squeezing them in here, Next, I'm re reaching for two crotons, which I am putting on the opposite sides of each other. And here I am making space for a center piece. This here is a house plant, which requires low lights. It's called your best friend plant <laughs> or my best friend plant if you watch to the end you'll find out what really happened next you'll see me grab the super cow pecoias adding fall color I am covering the house plant due to it needing more shade than the rest of this container. From behind, I'm going to put contrasting color. I have yellow there, so I'm going to put orange over here and yellow on the opposite side. Now, I think you all will be able to see the touch of purple, so I'll add in if it can fit. I don't believe. It's not going to fit. <laughs> I really want it purple, but I'm not going to do that to that verbena. So let's see what else I have. What other option? Let's see how big. Oh, yeah, this will work. Take all the soil out. See, all the soil just falls right out. So I have a hole. This is mini containering. Y'all, in reality, this needs way more space. So I have to find another solution. Don't talk about me too bad, but here we go. missing a little bit of color a little bit of color let's see I 
I have a second option. Let's see. Ooh, bye -bye. I got Marcus beats. What do you all think? Let's move that on out the way to the side. What do you, you think I got it, Legend? Boom. Legend thinks I got it. I think I got it. We shall see. I love it, you all. I love it. I love every angle of it. Oh. All right. This entire container will be placed in part shade. Of course, the Super Cal Pacoas, which are petunias with, mixed with Calabrocchia Super Cows, they could survive in part sun. So I did go for the effect of the Barberry and the Super Cal Pacoas fighting for light. Part shade, Barberries will do well in part shade. In the back, we have Lisi Machia Outback Sunset, which also has been in part sun this entire season. It has done well, but it prefers full sun. So in the fall, most things won't require full sun because there won't be full sun anyways. <laughs> but that's my container. All right, everyone. I'm sad. <laughs> it's for real I'm real sad Gun Queen told me that most people wouldn't know how to plant up in a small container I'm looking down at the container as beautiful as it is but this container have no room for growth which means it's only going to be cute for like two weeks so in the redoing Marcus is going to do this the correct way inside of a urn that has more depth to give the roots enough space to grow. I refuse to let this beautiful plant container fail. So what that means is we're going to start all over. Stick around if you want to see Marcus's turn. And I'm not afraid to admit that I'm the person that did not choose the right plants and they did not plant the right plants up inside this container. So watch that one on another episode. See you in my next one. Bye-bye.